All right, looks like I am live. This is Stephanie Treasure and welcome to this live stream. I'm right now streaming this in the Passionate, Purposeful and Powerful Entrepreneurs group. But if you're watching the replay on another page or one of my, uh, possibly my Facebook page or my YouTube channel, welcome to you as well. I'm excited to be here. We are in the second week of the Visibility Impact and Profit Giveaway. Uh, it's been going great so far. This is a two week event. That's happening right now. It ends on September 30th. So if you haven't yet signed up, I've put a link to the event in this caption. It's a visibilityimpactprofitgiveaway.com. This is a completely free dynamic event where top experts share what's working now to build a successful coaching empire with a global reach that makes a massive impact. During this event, once you log on to the URL that I've shared, you're able to sign up or register for the event completely free, and you will be able to access just under 30 resources brought together by these experts, these leaders that I have, in, I have invited to join me in bringing this event to life. So that's how the first phase of this event works. You log in and you get access to, there's a resource that I've presented as well. That's a live resource happening um, just next month. And then you're gonna get access to just under 30 resources from the experts that are designed to help you to get more visible, to bring in more clients, make a, in, a bigger impact and profit in your business. So those, those resources are gonna help you in the areas of visibility, marketing and sales, client attraction, legal uh, mindset, and social media, as well as events management. You'll be able to access those, those resources and be able to put them to use to help you in those areas or with those aspects of your business. These, are, these resources brought together by these experts are high value. They come in the form of worksheets, templates, guides, workbooks, um, video training, um, uh, webinar training, master classes, you know, um, recordings of the same. So you'll be able to, in, in some cases, it's that you get access to a bundle. Once you can access those resources there, but in addition to that, uh, there's some of the experts that are featured here in this giveaway. These are sponsors and spotlight experts, featured experts. And they will, they, some of them have decided to sit down in a deep dive video interview with me where I, dive, I, I drill down more in terms of what the resource is that they're bringing to this giveaway, as well as some additional tips that can help persons who get access to these resources and want to really take their business to the next level. So you definitely want to sit, on, sit in on those interviews and you can access them in the Facebook, Facebook group at the Passionate, Purposeful and Powerful Entrepreneurs group and on my Facebook page at facebook.com slash Stephanie Treasure Biz. Once you sign up, you're gonna get a link to those things. If you're watching this elsewhere, you're not in the group, you're not on the Facebook page, you haven't signed up for the event, you don't know what I'm talking about, where to find this, you can access this event um, and these resources by logging on to visibilityimpactprofitgiveaway.com, right? So that's what you need to do first order of business. If you're watching this, you haven't heard of the event or you've heard of it, but you haven't signed up as yet. The window is closing soon on when these, these resources will continue to be available. So now is the time to register. And I'm gonna ask you for a favor, pretty boldly, right? I'd like for you to share this with a coach, consultant, or service-based provider in your words that you're friends with, or you're in, an, in a paid program with, or you're in another group with. I really want for as many people to get access to this resource, because honestly, under one umbrella, under one virtual roof, so to speak, you hardly find so much value. And as I mentioned, it's my, well, I haven't mentioned this, but it's my mission to help more persons in the business consulting and coaching and service-based space to get more visible, be able to bring in more of their targeted leads, the people who really want their services, be able to pick them out from the crowd, bring them into your platform, bring them into your programs and help them to get the results and the transformation that they desire. 
I know that you're passionate about what you do. I know that you have the secret sauce as it relates to your specific area of expertise. And I know that you know that it doesn't make sense to keep it all to yourself or to the small numbers that may either know you personally because they're already existing in your world or may meet you in some of the networking events or some of the places where you're hanging out. You know that more people need this support, more people need your services. If you're a rock star creating websites or helping persons to manage their social media platforms or helping with them with their admin or helping them with their bookkeeping or with their mindset or with their finances or money, their business, business growth, whatever it is that you do, you know that you have the secret sauce that helps your clients to get great results. Why would you keep that to yourself or to the small numbers that you're already exposed to? Your mission, your, the onus is on you as a business owner to get this out to more people. And just by virtue of doing that, you'll continue to grow. You'll be able to leverage your services, or at least that should be your next step. And then you'll be able to scale. And then the amount of people that you'll be able to help will be just about on that exponential curve. And that should be your mission and your purpose as a business owner. So start right now with this free resource at, uh, through the Visibility, Impact, and Profit Giveaway event and get access to the uh, resources that are there for you by these top experts who have put passion, blood, sweat, and tears into the resources that they're presenting here that they could easily sell uh, for various amounts from 47, 97, um, 197. There are some persons who are offering you an opportunity through these resources that are worth, that's worth $1,000, right? So get access to these resources for free through this giveaway event and share it with your friends who you know need to access this as well. So I want to welcome you again to this live stream. I usually go live each Tuesday at 11 a.m. Eastern. And what I aim to do in these live streams is to share with you what's working now in um, in your, uh, what's working now for my business, what I see working now as uh, in terms of the trends that I follow, in terms of the studies that I, that I follow, things that I read about, things that I'm experiencing, things that I'm sharing with my clients, things that I'm doing in my own business, right? So that you can glean some insight um, as to what could possibly work for you and be able to apply it to your business. Of course, the, tra the, the information that I share with you here is not all encompassing step-by-step -step strategy focus so that you can actually really implement it with total certainty. Uh, you'd have to be working with me as a client to be able to get that kind of support, but you can definitely gain some insight that can shift your perspective and open and inspire new ideas and open the door uh, for you or the pathway for you to uh, seek more support either from me or from another uh, resource to uh, implement what you learn or from the insight that you gain here in these, uh, through these live streams, okay? So I wanna share with you today, as you may see in the caption, I wanna share with you how to prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough, breakthrough, right? So if you're watching this and you don't feel that you are as visible as you should be or could be, you know the value of what it takes to be more visible. You know the potential that it has to really open you up to more leads and more targeted clients. And you're ready for more of that, more of all of the above, more uh, visibility, more leads, more clients, more um, uh, growth, right? And profitability, more profit in your business, right? You're ready for all of that and then some right? So you're ready for your breakthrough. You're ready to take things up several notches and really get serious and focused and intentional about your visibility right now, this month, this quarter, and keep moving forward, right? You know that you're on that track, but you want to make sure that you're ready for that eventual breakthrough, right? As I mentioned before, the, the resources in this giveaway can, is, you know, will set you well on your way, right? Once you utilize the resources where you know that you are um, lacking on your own, you're, you're not proficient in that area as it relates to your visibility and you're going to take steps to improve upon that and really take things next level, right? 
but you want to make sure that you're ready for what's to come, right? So I want to share with you, you know, well, let me, let me to just give you even just another qualifier or example of what I mean to prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough. You may be in a place where, based on how you're working, um, you have bandwidth for one-on-one -on -one clients only. You probably don't even have a group program. And really, that's one of the keys to really leveraging your time in your business is offering one-to-many and you know that you're yourself ready for that breakthrough would mean one of those things would be to conceptualize a group coaching program and possibly a funnel that would work your new leads into that program, okay? So, and that's not one of the things I'm going to share in terms of priming yourself for your visibility breakthrough, but I really want for you to think about how you can be ready for the visibility that you seek, that you're going to pursue through the resources that you learn from this giveaway or through coaching or however, however you're going to do it. You really want to make sure that you are ready and you really set yourself up for success. All right. So I'm going to share with you five things that is going to help you, that are going to help you to prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough. If you're watching this and you can get excited about that, comment below with the word visibility. Comment below with the word visibility, right? I may just have something for you on the flip side of that. So I encourage you to, do, to comment below with that word visibility. And I'll be in touch with you via private message to let you know what that is. But I really want for you to get ready for what I'm going to be sharing today. Take notes or, you know, save this uh, live stream so that you can watch the replay and absorb it a little bit more, a little bit deeper. I'm not quite sure if you're watching this and you're multitasking, but I really want you to take heed of these five things. These are important things, important, important factors and, and, and items that would help you to prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough. All right, ready? Okay. I'm just, I was just checking to see if there were any comments as yet. Okay, so, so far I don't see any live comments, but again, if you're watching this replay, go ahead and comment below. If you're watching it on YouTube, comment there. I get the notifications that you do and I'll come back and respond. If you're watching this on my Facebook page, comment there as well. If you're watching this in the group on the replay, comment there and I will get back to you, all right? I wanna keep this thread interactive. I want for you to know that you can ask your questions, you can share your viewpoints and you know get a conversation going with me as well as I, I didn't say this at the outset, but if you'd like to reach out to me privately to talk about what it may look like for you to work with me privately or to um, get some support through whatever resources I have out there that can help you even more with your visibility, do let me know. But right now, the main resource that you need to be plugged into is the Visibility Impact and Profit Giveaway while it's still live, all right? So here are the five things. Number one, and I'm gonna go through, I'm not gonna say them all, I'm gonna go through each one, one by one. So the first thing that you wanna do or take into consideration to prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough is your profiles and your image on social media. Your profiles and your image on social media. So here's what I mean. If you really wanna prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough, for being seen, being heard, being found, being respected, being trusted by not only your uh, ideal potential clients, but also other colleagues, you really want to make sure that your profiles are up to scratch, right? And your profiles, believe it or not, your social media presence, and you may be watching this and you have a website and you, and you may be thinking, but the website is, is up. I invested in the website and that's doing its thing. And that's great. And that's actually, that should be part of this line item. So you want to make sure that your profiles and your image on social media, as well as on the internet, 
right? You want to make sure that those items are ready. So yes, you should have a website that's on brand, that conveys who you are and what you do, has a well thought out about me page, has a way for you to be contacted, as well as share some information about why you started this business and the way that you work with people, right? You certainly want to make sure that that website has a uh, lead capture on the homepage and actually should be on every page so that when people visit your website, you're able to capture those leads. Because when you start to get really visible and people Google you, they'll come across your website. Or if you're speaking and you, they, you know, they ask you where, you where people can get in touch with you and you mention your website, you want for your website to be ready to receive the inflow of traffic that's going to come its way. The same thing with your social media uh, profiles and your image, even your personal profile. You want to make sure that you have a professional headshot. It shouldn't be a headshot of a flower or it certainly, certainly should not be the default um, silhouette that Facebook has on your profile, right? It should have a picture of you. Uh, preferably a professional headshot, um, not just a, um, how do you call it? What, not just a emotionless, emotion-free passport-sized uh, image, right? It should be something that looks professional, a bust shot, and, um, you know, a picture of you, right? At your best, right? So that's for your personal profile. Even your professional profile, certainly it should have a professional photo. You wanna make sure that your cover photo um, has an image of you, has possibly either your title or um, a quote or your tagline or talks about in just your one-liner in terms of the work that you do or the people that you're working with. Um, what it is you stand for, what you know, who you are, something that should be conveyed on that uh, that cover photo, and then even your profiles. You want to be able, you want to make sure that it's current, right? I shouldn't visit your profile and find that the last post was in 2018, right? It doesn't have to be every single day if you don't have the bandwidth for it. For although you should be working on your content marketing, and there's a resource in the giveaway, one of uh, our experts, one of the experts, Donna Duffy, she has a 90-day content and visibility planner there for you that you can access right now that can help you with content. So no excuse right there, right? But you should have some content that's current on your Facebook page. Same thing with Instagram, same thing with LinkedIn. You want to make sure that you're keeping current on your social media profiles, that your image is professional, even on your personal profile as well as business. And just really quickly with a personal profile, right? Um, there's different schools of thought as to the idea that HR professionals, when they're considering you for hire, look at your personal or your, your personal profiles on social media or your image on, on social media. And most of what you post, unless you, you, know, you use the private, certain privacy settings on some of these profiles, um, most of what you post is visible to other people. You want for when people see those profiles, they're gonna see things that are meaningful, that make sense, and they're gonna see some posts, um, some posts on your profiles. It's, so it's, with, as it relates to the HR professionals, you want to, you, when you apply for a job, you really want to be judged on your own merit, on your experience, on your education, your background, and what you bring to the table, and of course, how you perform in the interview. And so you may be uh, listening to me and you're thinking that, so my social media profile, however I spend my private time, shouldn't matter. It shouldn't matter, but it does in a way, right? Yes, we all like to have fun and it's okay to have fun, but your, your potential employer and indeed your potential clients, they want to know how, you know, what matters to you. You know, they may want to know what your politics are, right? What your politics is or how you, how you fare on politics, right? Um, I personally don't share that information, so you're not going to find that about me, right? You have an idea. There's some things that I 
would post or if, if there's an election and, and I'm happy for who won or I'm congratulating them, you may, you may see something there about my politics, right? And like I said, it shouldn't matter, but it kind of does, right? The same thing in the HR situation. So what you share in your profile shouldn't matter, but it kind of does, or at least how you present yourself on your profile. Right now, I can tell, tell you very clearly without apology that I have about, I checked this morning, I have 189 requests to join this or to join my Facebook group, depending on where you're watching this, that I have not approved for one reason or the other. One of the main reasons that I don't approve persons to join the group that request to join my Facebook group is when they don't have a profile picture and they have that default silhouette. At the very, very least, you should have a picture there. Even if you haven't had a chance to do a pro professional headshot, right? You should at least take a selfie, a decent selfie, put on something that you have at home that you possibly wear to an interview or that you'd possibly wear to a semi-formal engagement and take a selfie or you know, put your phone on timer, stand behind your, your phone camera and take that picture and put it up on your personal profile. But if you try to join my group and you don't have a personal profile, it, you're, it's, it's almost automatic that you're not gonna get approved, right? The other thing that I look for, if you do have a personal profile picture, because some people actually use fake pictures, I take a look at the profile to see what you post. If somebody tries to join the group that has no posts, nine times out of 10, I'm not gonna approve you to join the group. You should have something to say, even if it's just sharing family pictures or if it's sharing pictures of your garden or um, sharing articles of interest to do with your field of expertise, but something should be populated on your profile. People look at that, right? So make sure that your profiles are ready for your visibility breakthrough so that when people Google you and they do a search and they come across your Instagram profile, Facebook profile, um, whatever profiles you have out there, make sure that it's ready to see those people, that it conveys a little bit about you and your business as well as give you a chance to capture those leads, uh, gives you an opportunity to capture those leads. So your profiles should possibly have as a pin post, your free offer as, and, and your websites, when they visit the website, they should, you should have a lead capture there as well, okay? So that's number one. The second thing you wanna make sure that's in place is your branding. You wanna spend some time on branding. Branding is a, can be a significant investment depending on who you're, you know, how, what route you go, right? Uh, one of my colleagues uh, on my last event back in May, uh, Jordan Duval is a branding specialist and she helps her clients in various ways with their branding, right? But branding is important. You should have a uniform look and feel and message and color and all the things uh, that go into how people perceive your brand. So you want to make an investment there. Investments are necessary, newsflash, investments are necessary for a success, successful get used to it, it's something that you're going to have to do. But I'm prioritizing other things and my branding is intact in other places that I'm visible. Um, just not quite with the website right now, right? But that's, an, that's something that I'm going to be working on in the near future. The third thing that you want to take into consideration when you're priming yourself for your visibility breakthrough is what your exposure and your online presence looks like outside of your platforms, right? Or what is your strategy in terms of getting visible outside of your existing platform. So there's some amount of visibility, as I have alluded to before the other, uh, with the first point for sure, in terms of how you're presented, in terms of making sure you have a profile picture, making sure branding is intact, making sure you're posting, posting content on your personal profiles and showing up for your existing community. However, 
you should have a strategy for the exposure that you're looking to gain and the visibility that you're willing to, uh, looking to gain outside of those platforms where you already have people gathered, right? Um, are you appearing on podcasts? Are you writing articles? Are you speaking on live stages? What's your, are you networking, right? What's your, your exposure strategy or your visibility strategy outside of your platforms? You should have one and you should be giving that its due attention as well, right? The fourth thing you wanna take into consideration when you're priming yourself, your brand, your business for your visibility breakthrough is your message. What are you talking about? What are you sharing? What, are, what do you stand for? What is your chief goal? What is your mission? How are you speaking to your persons? What are their pain points? What are their visibility um, points? Their, 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 what, is their, uh, what, are their, what is their mission, right? If you're not speaking to pain, then you should be speaking to pleasure. What they want, right? What does that look like? What is your key message? Uh, in politics, since I mentioned politics before, your message is your platform. What are you gonna lead with? What are you gonna stand for? Are you gonna campaign heavy on healthcare? Are you gonna campaign heavy on certain rights, right? H certain human rights, right? Are you gonna campaign heavy on immigration? What is gonna be your platform, your chief message in terms of how you're showing up to your people, what you're writing about, what you're talking about, what you're speaking about? What is your central message, right? Um, possibly one to three or five points that are the key things that stand out, that you rally around, that you talk about, that you share in video, in, in written, in the written word, the, the key things that you're speaking to as it relates to your chief message, right? For your, that will resonate with your targeted audience, right? And that your colleagues will be able to recognize and know that this is your thing and they will be able to be clear on what that is and invite you to speak on their stages, right? Possibly invitations to podcasts or summits or real life stages, right? Your message should convey throughout all that you do, your website, all your social media platforms and even through your branding, right? So get clear on what that is as you prime yourself and prime your brand for your visibility breakthrough, okay? The fifth thing that you should keep into consideration when you're priming yourself for your visibility breakthrough is your signature talk. Your signature talk is that topic, that umbrella topic. This could be specific. You don't really want to get specific here as well as the umbrella theme that you tend to speak about so that when you get asked to speak on stages like summits and podcasts and real life stages, you know what you're going to run with, you know what you're going to speak about and you're ready to go. You certainly cannot apply to be on stages or get asked to be on stage if, if you don't know what your talk is, what your signature talk is, because the first thing that somebody who's hosting a summit is going to do if they're, as they're looking for speakers and looking for and, and evaluating the kind of content that they want to bring to their audience, they're going to want to know what you can speak about. What do you bring to the table? What can you share? The podcast host is going to want to know the same thing, right? So what's your signature talk? You should spend some time there and it, it will come from, or it will be a derivative of what, of what your messaging is, right? So once you know what your messaging is or the platform that you're running on, then you can actually sit down and extrapolate one to three or even more signature talks that you can present on, that you can compile and put together and run with it when asked to appear on stages or podcasts or writing articles, um, you know, because you, you can have a signature topic that you write about as well, right? So you should be clear on what your signature talk is as you're priming yourself for your visibility breakthrough because you're going to get invitations or as part of your visibility strategy, you're going to make pitches to appear on stages and you need to know 
and be clear on and be able to sell the value of what you bring to the table. You can do that in your signature through knowing what your signature talk or talks are, right? So those are the five things that you wanna take into consideration and really sit, time, sit down and spend time on and, and, and you know, prepare those items as you prime yourself for your visibility breakthrough. I know that you're ready. I know that you have, if you haven't already, you're going to sign up for the Visibility Impact and Profit Giveaway, where you'll be exposed to many resources that's gonna help you to get visible in various aspects. Take care of the house first, right? Or, or take care of the house simultaneously at least. See what you can do to put things in order as you ready yourself for your visibility breakthrough. All right? I know I shared a lot and you may have questions. I wanna let you know that you can always pose your questions through commenting below the post or messaging me privately. Each of these platforms has a messaging system. Um, you can message me on my Facebook, through my Facebook page. You can message me, message me to my personal profile through Instagram. You can uh, email me, uh, send me a message info at stephanietreasure.com or you can message me through LinkedIn. I'm quite accessible. If you look at my website or if you're in the group or following me on any of these pages, I'm very responsive and I'll get back to you. And if I miss it, somebody on my team will let me know that there is a message there for me, all right? I'd love to hear your viewpoint. I'd love to hear your questions. Um, I'd love to hear any aha moments around what I shared with you today. I'm here to support you as best as I can. All you have to do is reach out and for now, I definitely want you to take advantage of the Visibility Impact and Profit Giveaway. Sign up for this resource right away. Set aside some time, at least 30 minutes, to go through the resources and claim access to what you know is right for your business right now, as well as those resources that you want to put on in your virtual library for when you're going to need it down the road or for when you're executing a strategy at another time or in your business, right? So a tip for you is to create a folder on your computer or, or on Google Drive or a Dropbox, however you're storing things and get access to all the resources, right? File them in the respective folders uh, according to topic, right? or according to the time that you're going to use it, possibly set a, note, uh, a reminder on your calendar to revisit a specific resource at a specific date in the future, right? And then implement what you have learned, okay? Another tip for you, again, invite somebody to join you on this giveaway and hold yourselves accountable as accountability partners to download and actually implement or put to use one of the things, one of the tips or strategies that you learn from the guides or worksheets or templates or scripts or video training or webinar training, whatever is available, whichever one you download or whatever uh, format it comes in, hold each other accountable for making use of those items. All right. So that's it. I'm going to wrap up here. Thank you for joining me on this live stream. I do hope you found it valuable. And I look forward to seeing you on the next live stream. I look forward to seeing you on the inside of this giveaway, downloading these resources. If you happen to download the resource that I've presented on this giveaway, reply to the email that, that I send you um, and just say hi. And I'd love to hear what your business is about, what you're excited about this month, this quarter, and what you're working on. And of course, if you have any questions whatsoever, right? So I look forward to interacting with you in the Facebook group where this live stream is being held after you watch the replay. And, um, and certainly I look forward to keeping in touch. Take care for now. Have a productive rest of your day and week. And I'll see you next time.